got my big boy pants on today and I'm just gonna try to get this 50. Oh, I was in and I got scared. Oh. <laughs> All right, back at the local again. I'm trying to learn half cab crooks, but uh, it's a struggle. You can do like half cab nose, but half cab crooks, it's getting that pinch. Kind of weird coming from fakie. Yep. Try run a half cab nose. Oh, too far away. Oh, this is probably too much speed. <laughs> that was like the inch of my nose. I was legit like this. Oh, that was sloppy. I want like a nice uniform, like knees bent, cab nose, pop out. Once I can get a clean one, I'll try to go for K. Oh, my heel drag. All right, here. Oh, that one felt good. I'm gonna try to get on earlier. I'm gonna try to get on like right here. Aim to like, so I have to probably pop from like earlier. Oh, I wasn't all the way in. Nah, shouldn't be hard. It's like a basic trick. Ooh, right here. Ah, you whore. Oh! Ah, uh, I feel like I wasn't all the way in. I want to be on top of this. That felt solider. Oh my god, there was no pop. This is ridiculous. That felt better. Yo! So I really want to try hit this out ledge. Just the ollie, no slide, then maybe ollie crook. Maybe kick flip up and then crook. We'll see. Oh, shit. <laughs> Overthinking. Thinking too much about it. Oh, there we go. Now I've got to try to do the crook. It's not that high coming off the manual pad, but from the flat, it's like a decent height, but just a little baby pop crook, I think. <laughs> I went straight into no slide, dude. Oh, that wasn't as pinch as it could have been. It was kind of like, not that good of a pinch. Maybe I need to go slower. I'm like charging at it too hard. I just need to get that nice pinch. This is it right here. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. Oh, I'm gonna try a kickflip up crook. Maybe I'll try throw a few goes at it. Just a kickflip. Even if I just do kickflip no slide, it's chill. Woo! Jesus. Oh, first tee, kind of easy. Maybe I'll try a crook. Oh, God damn, that felt good. <laughs> I need a dr drink, dr drink, drink. I need a drink, 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 drink. Thinking about a new one. What if I were to do ollie up, front smith, front tail. Front nose would be cool as well. Let's just, uh, let's start with just a 50-50 but I reckon. Oh, I wasn't even locked in. Oh, there we go. Oh, that was my first try front tail. Sloppy, went to fakie. Sometimes my weight just keeps going. I actually struggle with front tails, believe it or not. So I just want to get a nicer version of that. Even if I go to fakie or come out normal, I'll be happy either way. This is just like a little early morning skate sesh gym. Get your reps in, get out. Oh, um, thank God that was second try. I absolutely don't like that trick. <laughs> like I got, I got hurt pretty bad doing this trick on something I shouldn't have been doing it on. So uh, what's next? We'll try front smithers. I'm kind of getting hungry to be honest. All I had was a fruit bowl this morning. Try a front smithers and then uh, see where we go. <laughs> I don't know if it's sticky or I just didn't put my weight in the right spot, but I definitely didn't go. I don't think it's sticky. I think I just need to like lean into the trick more. Front Smith, you're like this. And I was kind of like on top, like a 50. Could hear my kin, kin pin, king pin dragging. <laughs> we're back at the most playful flat bar in the world. Feebles are fun. I still haven't like committed to like a 50 back or front. I feel like back's a little less squeaky than front. A little more speed would have been nice. What should I try? Back 50? Oh, I was supposed to do for Smith. Hang on, let me do for Smith first. 
Mr. Smith. There's chunks coming off this rail. All right, what are we doing? Back 50, front 50. Let's try front, and I'll just try to get a nice cross lock. And yeah. Oh, I was in and I got scared. Oh. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that sucked, dude. It didn't hurt, it was just scary. <laughs> in the air like this. <laughs> I, I hesitated. <laughs> oh my god. I got my big boy pants on today and I'm just gonna, yeah, try to get this 50. I think I got too cocky. I tried to pop from like here when I should have just been popping from here just to get comfy. Which isn't bad, a little bit of confidence isn't bad in skating, but in this case it's better to just take small steps. So I'm just gonna pop from here, try to get a front 50. This is the one. The problem earlier was like I wasn't bending my knees before I popped. I just kind of popped and my knees went, legs went straight, threw me straight into toe side. Woo. It was heels, toes, heels, whatever, but I got in, I got out. I just try to think feeble when I do backside 50, just think feeble, because literally feeble's here, back 50's there. And if I can get a good cross lock, I'm chilling. Oh, that was way less scary. I feel like I'm better at like locking in to cross lock back 50. Yeah, le way less scary than front. I would have thought it would have been the opposite, but it's been a minute. <laughs> that was so sketch. <laughs> that was sketch, but I'm gonna take it because my ankle is kind of bugging right now and I'm trying to skate tomorrow too. Heading out right now, got some super sh sick stuff to do today. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. I know I'm gonna enjoy it because I've been waiting since basically last winter to go out and do this, but there's been fire bans and restrictions and don't wanna break the law. So yeah, got some sick stuff lined up. Oh yeah, that's the good stuff. This week, September 10th through the 16th at 7 p.m. Sean P. Diddy Combs has been using proactive solutions. Hey, how's it going? We're in sync. You know. What is going on? <sighs> you know what? Honestly, this is so stupid. So I've literally waited for like nine months for summer to finish, winter to kick back in because there's fire bands during summer, you can't go shooting on BLM land. So I've waited like nine months to do this stupid little skit. I got a bunch of like paint that is unusable right here. So there you guys can't really see, there we go. A lot of paint that I'm not gonna use or that the tins are just broken because the valves are like done. So brought the shotgun and the Glock and yeah, I'm gonna have some fun shooting some stuff in the desert. What color? What color should we do first? I'll try to give you guys a better look. Maybe comment down below what color you wanna see me do. I've got blue, I've got red, I've got green. So comment down below right now and I'll choose that color. I'm gonna go with the blue 94. Um, I wanna stack up like a pyramid and then like shoot them down one by one. But let's just start with this one first. Let me take some steps back. All right, you guys ready? So I am. That was that was very underwhelming. Not enough pressure in the can of paint or something, but Blah, spewing. Blah, uh, um, that went right through. I don't know how well you guys can see, but that went right through. And don't worry, I am going to clean up all of this. That's why I brought this tote tray tub thing to clean up my mess. All right, what color next? Pink. What about teal? Let's do red. This one feels like it has a decent amount. And these these are like cans that I've had for like years. When I bought my Forerunner, the old lady was a mural artist and she gave me a bunch of tins. Um, let's see if there's any decent paint where, yeah. Okay, kind of, it's kind of some paint left in here, a little bit. There's a little crosshairs for you. 
There you are. Look at that. This feels like it has a decent amount of paint in it, so I'm gonna shoot that one right now. This is fun. Missed. Oh, <laughs> that one was way better. That, I, feel, I feel like that one was like, boom! Like there was more going on. I'll do this brown Montana gold here. This is a table I use to like work in the garage with and like fold t-shirts and stuff for evening. So I'm definitely gonna have to let this dry for a long time before I do any more work on it. I'm gonna move these cans out of the way so I don't get any more overspray. We have this can of brown Montana gold and it's about to become brown bread. These are really, that I didn't, ex I thought there would have been a bigger, bigger boom with that one. Oh, you ever seen the inside of a can of paint before guys? Look at that, straight through it. That's a pretty clean hole, right through the can of paint. Should have brought some gloves. If I get the shotgun out right now, put a whole stack and just boom, like all the colors. It's like what they, uh, what they do in India when it's holiday and they throw all the colors around. That's what it looks like. Three on the top. Like the, like the leaning tower of Pisa. All right, let's just do, let's just do that. Three, two, one. <laughs> Blew it right off the hinges. This is so sick. Honestly, the colors look really good right now. Look at it. It looks like a big rainbow paddle pop emptied itself out onto this table here, my merch table that I've been using. Uh, did I get all of them? I feel like I didn't get all of them. Oh no, look at the little buck shots through there. Wow. Look at all the colors. It's like a Mr. Beast video. This TV is probably about ready to uh, go back to Best Buy, their uh, recycling policy. So might have to run that down to Best Buy this week. I'm just gonna throw this in the air. And then if I get this first try, you gotta go buy something from eveningmob.com. <laughs> that was first tea. Head on over to eveningmob.com, pick something up. <laughs> Gonna do another one. Lighting was, is better from this angle. It's a pink. Make sure we got one in. We got one in the chamber. Ah! All right, here we go again. <laughs> this is so much fun, honestly. If I have one more, I'm gonna run it back real quick. One second. <laughs> Usually it takes me like a few goes, like at least like three or four goes, but I've been hitting these ones like accurately. I mean, it is buckshot, but you know, this is a lot of fun. Just to prove to you guys that I cleaned up, do this graveyard tins. So yeah, all my shells, all the tins I shot, they're in here. I'm gonna be thrown in the rubbish bin. Burn rubber as I left the face.